Hello guys, welcome to my new Changing Impact video. Guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you full F2P Sino. Uh, I know Sino is not a F2P player. Sino is a five share player, and only way you can get Sino is by wishing on the exclusive character event wish character event banners like Sino having a rerun right now in the game, and you can wish on Sino and get Sino. But Sino is not a F2P player. You have to spend your wishes in order to get Sino. But in this video, I just want to show you a Sino F2P build with a pure proper F2P team. The team I'm using the Barbara, Coley, and the Traveler. Traveler, Traveler, Coley, and Barbara. But these all three characters are free. We we get this character for free. Barbara we got free. Coley we got free, and Traveler is also free. Only on Traveler I'm using the Skyward uh, Black Black Sword, but uh, uh, on Coley I'm using the Stringless, and on Barbara I'm using using the tra trailing tails of uh, Slayers. And yes, guys, on all character I'm using the F2P build. Except one thing that I'm using the black sword on uh, on traveler because I don't have that much of artifact to give out to my traveler. Uh, I'm already having so many characters built and so many. Uh, I am already very limited on the artifacts, so I don't have that very good artifact to maintain the ratio. If you want to maintain the ratio, you can maintain the ratio without a crit weapon. But uh, right now I have to go with the crit weapon because I don't have that much artifact. You will see here I don't even have a four piece gilded on my traveler right now not even a two piece two piece set because i don't have that much of artifacts right now so uh, but i'm using the gilded on at least one character in this team so i'm using gilded on coley they're using stringless weapon here but my coal is only level 20 i can level up my coley let's see i'm also very short on Box guys, I can send my Kohli, okay, one time. I'm starting. I'm gonna lose all my books. So, okay, right now I'm having 50 level Kohli here, 70 level Barbara. Uh, with the 44,000 HP here, I'm having 684 Elemental Mastery here, I'm having 459 Elemental Mastery. Uh, Traveler is properly built with the talents uh, like almost on max and I'm having a C6 Traveler, I'm having C1 Kohli and I'm having C3 Barbara, I'm having C0 Sino. Uh, weapon I'm using on Sino is also F2P Kite and Cross Pair, it's a F2P weapon, it's a forgeable weapon you can forge this weapon in the game and uh, set piece i'm using the thundering fury the strat i'm having is 58 179 and the elemental mastery i'm having 365 i'm ha i'm here right now a little short on energy but uh, we'll see uh, we, we, on a, we only want to test the damage not the energy re uh, regeneration so this is the team this is the builds i'm using I'm using two piece healing bonus on Azra. Only I'm using four piece on Kohli and Turning Fury. So I just want to show you that how good is Sino uh, is uh, with the F2P weapon and the build and with the proper F2P team. This uh, video I'm uh, making this video just to be uh, just to be sure that how good is Sino if you play Sino as a pure F2P, giving a F2P weapon and giving a proper pure F2P team. I'm using two Dendro characters because uh, did with, with two Dendro characters I'm gonna I'm gonna get around around 100 elemental mastery for Dendro resonance. I'm gonna get extra elemental mastery from Traveler. I don't know about the Kli uh, Kohli, that's white Kohli there I guess Kohli is just here just to uh, you know trigger the dendro All resonance I don't have Kohli's level high so Kohli isn't gonna make any difference here it's just for the dendro resonance if you're having your Kohli properly built like to 90 level then maybe Kohli uh, will make some differences or will support this team Barbara is here to heal Sino and to trigger hyper bloom reaction sorry bloom reaction in uh, which way uh, after triggering the bloom reaction so Sino can trigger hyper bloom 
तो लेस गो गाइज लेस टेस्ट दिस टीम हाउ गुड और हाउ बैड दिस टीम इज मेक श्योर गाइज आई एम हैविंग फिफ्टी लेवल कोहली एंड सेवेंटी लेवल बाबरा बट माई ट्रैवलर इज ऑन मैक्स द टैलेंट्स आर मैक्स एंड द ट्रैवलर्स बिल्ड इज वेरी वेरी गुड लाइक प्रॉपरली बिल्ड बस आई एम नॉट यूजिंग एनी फोर पीस सेट ऑन ट्रैवलर यू कैन गो विद द गिल्डेड फोर पीस और यू कैन गो विद दी डेन रो डी वुड मेमोरीज फोर पीस सो लेट्स गो वाइज Germinate. Your sins weigh upon your soul. You stay condemned. Okay guys so this is the damage considering that I'm using the Barbara uh, that is that Barbara is on 70 level and my Cole is on 50 level with the talents of 222 it's a very stupid showcase i know it's a very sh stupid showcase but i just want to show you you know one like idea like how is going Sino is going to perform under the all F2B uh, player, player like characters these are very good team like Barbara is very good. Barbara can heal Sino and also can uh, trigger the bloom reaction. And if you're having the Kohli and the uh, Traveler uh, combine, they can uh, generate. Uh, they can deal a plenty amount of you know dendro damage, and they can apply dendro for a, a very long time. The thing is that uh, this team is still good, but my Kohli having the two levels and uh, my Barbara is only having a five level. So Barbara uh, with the less heal and Kohli with the less damage. But you can use this team. Now I want to. I I'm going to show you a team with all four star character. So what we're going to do now, we're going to just replace some characters in this team. Like I'm going to replace a uh, uh, Barbara with a uh, Diona. And then I'm going to replace Kohli with a uh, Shinkyu. So Shibu my Shinkyu and die. Diona is a C6. Considering my uh, Diona and Sino uh, is C6. You don't need Diona and Shinkyu C6 in order to use with uh, Sino. Yes, Diona C6 provide 100 elemental mastery, but that is not necessary. Like you don't need that 100 elemental mastery to deal high damage. Without that 100 elemental mastery, you can still deal very high damage. The point of this team is that you, with the Diona shield and the, with the Diona healing, your Sino will stay uh, alive. on the ground like sino will not die on the field with the duo with, with the duna shields and the heals and shinkyu will trigger the hyper bloom and yes traveler doing the same work triggering the uh, applying the dendro uh, dendro element so let's test this team now spring cutter you now be your dream spring for your sins weigh upon your soul guilty Your penance is due. Guilty. Your penance is due. Shake it off. Witness the power of Goa. Huh? Through me justice is served. Guilty. Your penance is due. Rain outlines your fate. Let me weave you a verse.
Oh yeah guys, this is a showcase with uh, the Traveler and the Weapon Kite and Crossfire. Now I want to show you with Mrs. Winspear because according to me, like my favorite weapon for uh, See, no, the F2 weapon is missive wind, uh, wind spare, but the thing is, this weapon is so rare that uh, it's a very exclusive uh, event weapon. Mihoy gives this weapon for free, but uh, not everyone has this weapon because it's an event exclusive weapon. You can only obtain this weapon during a specific event, but that event is gone and not gonna come in future. So, this weapon is not gonna come in future. Yep, never gonna come in the future so that's why this is a very special weapon but it's a f2b weapon because we get this weapon for free r5 weapon for free and i think this weapon is a bang on the best weapon for Sino. and guys now let's test this weapon and see the damage percentages <laughs> spring forth witness the power of google Judgment is upon us. You stand condemned. Guilty. Oops. I got my Vulcan. Okay, guys, so you already see the massive difference. Like, if you compare this this weapon to a kaiden cross pair there's a huge difference you can clearly see the bad damage percentages literally went to very high because this weapon gives you 96 elemental mastery along with a loss of lots of attacks so in my opinion this weapon is just right and perfect weapon for sino uh, if you own this weapon just level up this uh, weapon to 90 level and use this with sino so guys, uh, these are the teams that you can use. These these are not the only team that you can use. So let's just quickly talk about the different four stars and F2P characters team that you can use. First, let's talk about the proper F2P team that you can use with uh, Sino. One is that I showed you with the Barbara. Where is my Barbara? Barbara and now uh, you can uh, go for the, either the two electro characters or you can go for the oh, you know two you dendro characters you can definitely go for the two electro characters what's the point of having the two electro characters in the Sino team uh, one is the uh, particle generation two electro character will uh, generate more particles and have series less and you know overall having a having a little, uh, more uh, particle gen regeneration basically and second thing is gonna be you have a constant uh, application of electro so that is again a plus thing you can also go with the two dendro character and i already told told you about that you can go with the Kohli and yayo -Yo. but i don't recommend you to go with the Kohli because Kohli is not that good for sino what you can do you can go for the two dendro character and one's don't gonna be yeah. the yayo -Yo and the, if you having a yayo -Yo, yayo -Yo is also a healer so you can replace barbara here but other other hydro f2p option is not available like there's no other hydro character that mihoyo gives that uh, genshin gives uh, gives you for free there's only barbara hydro character that uh, genshin gives you for free but there's another option for sure option that you can go Chivalry with so you can do die. it like this you have a two dendro characters in the team one is the healer and you have a shinkyu for the four star for the hydro application and shinkyu is the one of is the best hydro four star hydro character in the game so guys there's a uh, there's a simple logic going on here either you're going to use a two electro characters in the team either and uh, other options are the you're going to gonna use the two dendro characters in the team hydro is gonna be very important so one hydro character is always gonna be the options so you are using sino with the two dendro one hydro or the sino with another electro and one hydro one dendro character these the this is going to be the option for dendro four char you have only two uh, two options in four stars currently or are uh, you saying you can say f2p yayo -Yo and the traveler traveler and yayo -Yo is the two only two options currently currently you have like i don't know about the future but currently you have only two options and these are very good like travelers and yayo -Yo both are very very good and in uh in hydro you have only two options again one is shinkyu and second is barbara 
in the four stars in the f2p characters and in the electro characters you have uh, plenty of options here you can go with the cookie here cookie also provide you healing so you can go with the cookie you can replace uh, one hydro uh, dendro character like you can replace yo yo here with Wait the cookie cookie will he uh heal your sino and will generate a particles and also cookie can trigger hyper bloom reaction second options are going to be the kujo sara kujo sara uh, why kujo sara because kujo sara is a electro element buffer kujo sara will buff your electro character gives uh, gives your electro character crit 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 damage and uh, attack buff so that's why you can use uh, uh, kujo sara also so these are two options in the electro again and third option is going to be the lisa you can also use lisa to so lisa kujo sara and Ku, uh, cookie is going to be the electro option in hydro you have two option barbara and shinkyu and in dendro you have again only two options are the uh, yayo and the traveler so these are the characters and the team that you can use with sino if you are a f2p and you have no other option like you have no options in the five shots these this video is purely for f2p and the four shards characters now let's talk about the weapon we have only two three weapons options here in the f2p one is going to be the kyrian crossbow second is going to be the moon piercer and third going to be the missive windsphere if i'm gonna rank this weapon i just rank the missive windsphere on number one kyrian crossbow on number two and moon piercer on number three moon piercer uh, and Kyrian Crossbear, these both weapons are the forgeable weapons. You can actually craft or forge these weapons in the game. And Missive Windsphere again is a free weapon, but it's an event exclusive weapon only obtainable through our event and that event is gone and so this weapon is not coming in the future if you already have this weapon you are very lucky uh, use this weapon but if you don't have this weapon you don't own this weapon <sighs> bye guys this weapon is never gonna coming not gonna coming never gonna come in the future so bye bye so these three options are the weapons option for Sino. so okay guys that's it for the video and we'll meet in the next video guys if you like the video you can hit the like button and you can subscribe to my channel for more change related videos in the future and guys we'll meet in the next video till then bye bye guys take care